No complaints. Not complaints. I'm happy to have it on the breakfast. Mm -hmm. So it's a, Boom. it's a, it's a quality it. one. So now that's how I like mushrooms. Nice chunky mushroom. Now. Hello there. Welcome back to Pink Beach Food Review. I'm Kaz. I'm Chris. Today we have come to the East Riding of Yorkshire. We have come to Bridlington. Bridlington. Beautiful Bridlington. Although it's not so sunny today, it's still a beautiful beach. Yeah. And we've come to try out. What's the cafe, Chris? It's called the Wish Cat Cafe. Well, looking forward to it. Two full English breakfasts. I've no idea what is on this breakfast, actually. It's a gluten-free, yeah, a gluten-free standard. Fancy it. Mm -hmm. Keep on watching because we're going to peak plays it all up. Hello, thank you for joining us today at Millington at On The Beach, shall we say. We're not at the Wish Cat Back Cafe. Yes. Yeah. Takeaway Wish Cat Cafe, standard full breakfast. And this is a gluten-free full breakfast. There we go. Which I'm very surprised at here because I didn't realise you're going to get sausages as well. Wow, they look oh, good, they? don't they? Interesting. Sausages and fried bread, the works, yeah. basically. It's exactly the same. It is, yeah. There you go. Looking forward to getting into it. Even got toast here and the butter. It's nice and melted there in the pot. <laughs> Lovely. Right, go into it. Should we get into this now? So we've got plum tomatoes, beans, mushrooms, one egg, two bacon. Two sausage. Yep. And hash bread. I say a, and a piece of fried bread going on there as well. Ah. Oh, wow. That's amazing, isn't it, really? Yeah. How good's that? It, yep, there it is, underneath there. Hiding under the crest. No worries. And I'll you know, to top it off, forget to say, we have got a nice brew, yeah. a nice cup of chai to have to uh, warm us up on this warm windy, the up. windy okay. day. Now I say they put some salad I'm tape there, that. keep it all. Yeah, look at that. Nice and fresh and warm. How about that, eh? It Isn't does. Thoughtful. That is service. So, Hello. before we start, we want to say hello to everybody. Yeah. Hello, Cheers. we're having a fantastic day. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers to you, Grace. Oh. Yeah, still Nothing warm. better than a good cup of tea to warm you up as a Chris. No. Food. Yeah. Right, go on. Get into it, Let's go get on. Into it. Right. Could do the egg test. Oh, look at that. Now it's not a runny egg, but it's okay. It's in the middle. It's saved. It's somewhere in the middle there. Oh, same as How's yours? How's that, eh? In the middle. It's all right. Yeah, that ain't it. We can cope with that. Yeah. Go on. How's the egg taste? Here's the egg. Okay. Interesting. Mm. Creamy. Does it mm. taste? Yeah. Fatty. No, it tastes nice. No. Excellent. No problem with that. Piece of bacon now. This is a good thick cut piece of bacon there. Mm. Yeah. I feel like that. Nice. Very, yeah. uh, right. it's a salty one. Quite salty, but which is nice. I like a bit of salty okay, bacon. Yeah, nice bit of mm. charring on there, isn't it? Mm. Okay. Let's cut that nice and steady. In we go. Mm. Yeah. So, mm. anyone been to Bridlington who watched this channel? Let us know down in the comments. And what's your favourite cafe? Have you got a favourite cafe? Yeah. Have you come here? Have you tried this cafe out? Mushrooms. Mushroom. Yeah, that's big. Now, that's how I like mushrooms. Nice chunky mushroom. Yeah. And okay. they're a fried mushroom, aren't they? Mm. Sometimes they can be boiled, can't they? That's a fresh mushroom. Fried. Fried? Yeah, nice big size. Well, it's not greasy spoon cafe vibe we're no, getting here. Not. 
Now, very pleasant people. You said, didn't you? No. As you know, I hide away in the car, ready to video Chris. He goes and gets the food. Hmm. And you said it was very homely in there, didn't you? It was like going back in time in a way. Yeah. A proper English cafe. Wow. You know. Do the toast. Lovely. Yeah. Well, what we see, we also saw gluten free, standard, vegan. There was a bit of vegan. That's right. And this cafe yep. does breakfast through to burgers and jacket potatoes, toasties, milkshakes. Uh, endless, really, I think. Right. Mm, sausage. Wow. Okay, well, that looks quite a nice gluten free toast. It's got the, uh, if you look, it's got the flour on the outside of it. So there it's a. Uh, Boom. So it's a quality one. It's a cool quality one, that is. So you go and have to try the sausage. Yeah. I can't wait to try mine in a minute. But... A little tinge of pepper in it, that. Can you taste the pepper? Yeah. Let's do a bit of to oh, this bit of butter. Let's get some butter on this. Butter. Churned butter. Yum, yum. So when you have your toast in the morning, do you use butter? Are you a butter fan? Or are you... <laughs> margarine. Do you believe in margarine or butter? I think there's always that debate, isn't there? Chemicals in the margarine, they say, but then... I don't know. Nowadays, actually, they reckon the butter's actually more healthy for you than the margarine, don't they? Well, there you are. It's, a, it's more pure. It's a debate, isn't it? Is, isn't it? it? I think you know. it's, it's more pure, really. It is. Correct. Just make sure nothing's blowing off. Oh, yeah. Got a bit more butter yeah. went on this yet. Got a plenty of butter. I mean, most of it's kind of escapes out of the actual packet, if you look, which is not a bad thing, is <laughs> You're it? You can drink it. <laughs> oh, I would have, I could. Hmm. There we go. Right. Yeah, try oh. it out. Watch the... Have a dip in this tomato. Mm. Messy hands. Oh. I'm oh. a messy pup. <laughs> Whole tomatoes, not chopped. How's that? Oh, yes. Yes. I'm very happy to have these. Oh, watch out. Everything's going to fly away. <laughs> One of them kind of days, isn't it? See, we were looking for, obviously, there's no rain, but there's the wind. You can't ever quite get it perfect, See the one over the other end, Tip? Hey. No, no. Beans. Oh, go on. Tastes like um, a farmhouse white bread, that to me. Yeah. Good quality. Good quality, that is. Hmm. Tastes good. Well, I'm yeah. enjoying every bit of this, mm. I'll be very honest with you. You go with the beans. No problem with Don't it. forget, I've not tried the gluten-free sausage yet. And that's an important factor. It because, is. Because, well, we've only ever come across one other cafe that does the sausage, which was amazing, by the way. Yeah, so let's see the one you whether made. That's right. This is good too. Silence means it's good. I'm surmising. <laughs> I mean, it's very nice, actually. Yeah? It's what I call the in the middle sausage. Yeah? Mm. Okay. No complaints? Not complaining. I'm happy to have it on the breakfast. Mm -hmm. It isn't your catering and it's not your... Should we say Lincolnshire or something Lincoln like that? Lincolnshire and Cumberland. But it's a nice one. Yeah. Hash brown. I'm enjoying this at the moment. I'll just have you a know what? Like that. I've got to do. I've got to it's enjoy it. It's got the um, onion. Bit of an onion, onion tang oh, in yeah. that, which tastes very nice again. Okay, yours is a bit lighter colour. Yeah. It's not as crunchy. But maybe they have to cook it in. You probably can get yours deep fried or something like that. Yeah, it will be, won't so that's it? That's what that is, isn't yeah. it? Go on, let's have a look. Go on. Bit of a crunch to it, maybe. Oh, aye. Yeah. The bag. I'm going with the baked beans. Try the baked beans out. Again? Sweet. Quite sweet tasting. Yeah. Now not they? Yeah, they are. There's nothing wrong with them. Tomatoes. Nice. Like I say, if we said... The big plum tomato. Correct. I'm a bit fussy, me. I don't like the end bits. That's fussy, though. Know. I don't like the end bits where the uh, seeds are, shall we say. But it's a plum tomato. End of the day, isn't it? 
Nothing wrong yeah, in that. I don't know. Again. I think that's okay, that. I don't have a problem. Mm. I'd come back there any time to try that. You know, sit down meal. Well. Like I say, the atmosphere was... That's what you came pleasant. down to, didn't it? You know, the atmosphere, the... Um... Just took you back to a, a time when, you know, you went in English cafes like that. When you when I was a young lad. Is yeah, it, it's that... You know, it's a homely feel, Very. and it's the like you're saying, the friendly. You've got that friendly smile to welcome you. That's right. You will always go back, won't you? So there's some more bacon. Yeah. With me egg. Have a look at this fried bacon bread. Bacon and egg. Fried bread. Mm. That's right, that, have I? Mm. It's not exactly soaked in fat. Well, it's not swimming in it if you catch my drift. How would you want it? I mean, that to me looks quite fried. I like it. That is, That's what it? I'm saying. It's not soaking in it, as, you know, like a sponge. Just it's a crunchy, yeah. Out type of thing. Aye. Mmm. That's, um... I like that. Yeah. Mmm. Bit of a sandwich. Let's have a go. I like that. So we've not got any sauce on this. We just want to taste it as it is. It does come with... Um, oh, we did give us some HP sauce. So. Yeah, you got some HP for yourself, didn't you, Chris? Yeah. Better ketchup if you want that as well. I personally don't like sausage on my breakfast because I feel it spoils all the natural flavours. Because you see some people, they love eating ketchup, everything. Mm. They don't even taste it first. There's chuck ketchup all over it. There's chucking salt all over That's it. Right. And they're not, you know, tasting it. See, the taste buds really need that stuff on it. Personally, I don't like that stuff. Excuse me, what do you mean, Nan used to say? Insult to the chef. A little bit. Covering it like that. <clears throat> but each their own. If you want to put ketchup all over your Christmas dinner and your yeah. whatever else you have, you do bon that. Appetit. Yeah, no problem. But not for me. Right. Well. There you go. So you can top. Yeah, yeah. As I say, the place is a five-star food hygiene. Mm -hmm. It's not a massive cafe. You walk in, you sit down, good seating areas, etc. Toilets, stuff like that. Very friendly. Yeah, very friendly. Very friendly. Right now, just going to show you the beach. It won't be. 30 seconds shot of the sea. I'm sure you want to see it a bit closer up. And we're going to come back with the pink reports. Okay. So, Kaz, what's your pink report? Hello. Pink reports of the day are the Bridlington Beach. This is for the, I can't say wild cat. It's not the wild cats. I want to think of a wild cat for some reason. A tiger. No, yeah. it's the Wish Cat Cafe. Just one street away from literally, if you know where Bridlington Fair is on the front here, on the North Beach, it's one street behind. Yeah. That's all it is. 200 yards. I think yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fantastic. Right. As for the pit report, I would say, well, we'll get the re, uh, yes. receipt and then you can decide whether okay. did it look value for money to you. So the price altogether was £23.90. 
90p, got two teas, two for breakfast, standard gluten free. Okay. Um, it had the full works on it. Maybe I'd expect sort of two eggs, maybe. You usually get two eggs, two sausage, mm. two bacon. Although a lot of cafes seem to do just one egg, don't they, nowadays? Two ash browns. You get two, two of each. Two, two, and sort of two. Yeah. But, but overall, it was a very um, pleasant, a very pleasant breakfast. Yeah. Um, with lots of quality ingredients. Definitely. Good bacon, not your thin stuff. Not full of whites. That's definitely. There was a it was really good. As that is from. Yeah. Easily. Yeah. Was your, was your sausage good? Did you oh, enjoy yeah, that? It was lovely. Not... Uh, not a Cumberland, a Lincolnshire. Mm. It's just definitely not a catering sausage. Just a little yeah. hint of pepper in it, which was nice. Yeah. Bit of flavour, yeah. some. Um, beans, sweet beans, quite sweet yeah, beans. Were. I'm not yeah. sure what make they were, but they were quite sweet, weren't they? Tomatoes, plum tomatoes to me. I don't know wherever you get them from. I always say exactly the same today. Mm. I, I couldn't really, you know, same fault them. Tomatoes different tin. Yeah, <laughs> mate, I think they are, to be honest with you. You know, yeah. Tea, very good. quality tea. I'm not sure if it is a Yorkshire tea, but it I don't does. I think it was. Was it honest. not? Oh, well, it does taste a bit Yorkshire to me, but maybe because I'm in Yorkshire, I've got the Yorkshire thing going on here. <laughs> the Yorkshire has got into you. It has got into the milk a bit. Uh. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Uh. So, all in all, mushrooms, good. Mm -hmm. Fry bread, really delicious. Yeah. Something I've not had no for problem. many years. It was really nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Not soaked in it. Not all in all, it, in. yeah, exactly. If, you, if you're around this area, in Bridlington, give it a go. We recommend it, don't we? I definitely and, um, recommend it. And we will now give you our pink scores. Pink score. Kaz? Yes. What's your pink score? Pink score is a good, well-recommended nine. Well recommended nine. Yes. For the Wish Cat Cafe, Bridlington, a good nine. Yeah? Yeah. What use? Go on, I'm going to go likewise. I consider it nine. Well deserving, not a big portion, but delicious. Everything about it, I enjoyed. The egg was running, maybe another egg, mm. but yeah, well deserved now. Definitely. Right, okay. Now we've got a couple more videos to bring you from the Yorkshire coast. So keep tuning in for them. And uh, nice to see you all again. And with that, Always remember to keep your spackle. Take care. Take care. Ta-ra. <laughs>